when comparing uh, values, uh, let's say in an if statement, you, you, you need to use some kind of a compression operator. And then there are a number of uh, such operators. We saw equal equal in the example, but there are actually two sets. One set is for numbers and one set is for strings. So these, let's go over them. And these are sort of the equal uh, part of them. So equal equal checks whether two, the two sides are the same number not equal checks whether they are not uh, the same number and these are just less than and greater than comparing numbers. These are comparing them the same values they can compare as strings. So this will check whether the two strings are equal or they are different and less than, greater than and so on. What does less than mean? So Perl is comparing them character by character based on the ASCII table. So if you have two strings, then they will pick up the first two letters and compare them. And if they are the same, then they go to the next letter. And if they are sa same, then they go to the next letter and so on until it finds two letters that are different. And then they check that it's checked which one is comes earlier in the ASCII table. And based on that, it will come if it will be less or greater. But why are why do we have two different uh, tools? It's because Perl it doesn't have it doesn't care about uh, the value in the variable, so it's not the, the value that drives how the operator works, but instead the operator drives how the values in variables uh, behave, and we'll see that uh, in a minute or when you take the next uh, video.